Hey everyone, welcome back to another r slash ask reddit video, hosted by me, Moose. Today we're going to be asking r slash ask reddit, what happened in your worst job interview? So let's get into it. Fell down the stairs when I was being shown around the building. Ended up breaking both fibula, a few bones in each foot, tearing some ligaments and cracking my tailbone. This happened in September and I'm still in pain. After the fall, I sat at the bottom of the stairs crying for about 15 minutes and finally managed to pull myself up. The woman showing me around said, So does this mean you don't want the rest of the tour? At an interview for a tech startup, they asked me, If you could be any animal, what would you be? I answered otter because, you know, fun, active, work well with their hands, and cute as fuck. They really debated whether or not to hire me because of that answer, because, and I quote, we only hire predators, never prey. And they weren't sure how to quantify an otter, because none of them had ever paid the least bit of attention to any sort of animal documentary, or read biology, or you know, just visited a zoo recently. God, that job sucked hard. It was for a software engineering position. The entire interview was focused around solutioning for a very specific problem. It was about 45 minutes of the interview team saying things like, that won't work, we tried that already. Left the interview without getting a solution to the problem. On the way out, I spoke with HR about what the potential next steps in the interview process were. She informed me they already filled the position, but didn't cancel any of the scheduled interviews. I was brought in to solve problems the team couldn't solve for free. I had applied for tons of jobs straight out of college, got a few interviews, went to one I had done research on the company and the job role. Got in, they started asking questions that I had literally no idea how to respond to, and talking about products I had never even used, or in some cases even heard of. Turns out, I had researched the wrong interview, and to this day, I don't fully know what that job was. I actually had to say mid-interview that I was sorry, but I had made a mistake and basically just ended the interview early. I was so embarrassed. Started off bad too, because the building had black windows, so I was fixing my hair in the mirror effect it gave off. When I went inside, I saw that the receptionist could see exactly what I was doing, as I was basically face to face with her, but outside the building. Was the interviewer. Applicant seemed fine on paper, an initial video interview went fine. During the course of the in-person interview, I got a complete history of the applicant's divorce, separation from child, and how if they had their lucky rock with them, it would have all have gone different. Then the individual produced the lucky rock for us to see and asked us when they could start. They didn't get the job. I had a scheduled interview at a law office as a receptionist. The morning before the interview, I was at the beach smoking bud with my friends when the office called and said they had moved my interview up a day and to be there in two hours. At this point, I was stoned out of my mind, so I went home, threw on some clothes, and drenched myself in perfume to cover any remaining smell of weed. I hopped on a bus and went to the interview. When I arrived, my eyes were still glazed and I was still fairly stoned. My dumbass decided to wear heels, and no more than five steps into the building, I biff it, tripping over their carpet. After I got up and pulled myself together, the interviewer approached me. We exchanged pleasantries and went into her office to talk. Needless to say, I blew the interview, stumbling over every sentence. But here's the real kicker. As I was leaving, I complimented my interviewer on her hair and asked where she got it done. She replied with, It's a hairpiece. I have cancer. I didn't get hired. Reading these, mine is pretty tame. But here it goes. I had an interview for a sales position at a life insurance company. I show up and it's actually a group interview. Huge red flag there. One person audibly says, fuck this shit, and walks out 10 minutes in. I want to do the same, but I'm polite, so I stick it out and then leave at the end without saying anything. Two days later, they call back and ask me if I want to come in for an interview. I assume they mean a follow-up interview and I decline and say I wasn't interested. Two days later, they call me again for the same thing. Eventually, I realize they aren't asking me back for a second interview, 
They are so disorganized and their turnover is so high that they don't realize they are calling the same people over and over again. This goes on every couple of days for two weeks before any calls finally stop. I was the interviewer. My candidate started off by making a comment how our receptionist's ass looked delicious. I was going to bring in a female engineer to chat with him and position technical questions, but I ended the interview early and saved her 15 minutes of her day. Buddy, hold it together. Forget about your penis during our interview and ask her out after if you get the job. Turned up for an interview. Manager was pissed off I had turned up in essentially the same clothes that he had on. Said he wanted to see how I would do behind the counter. After two people mistook me for the manager, he walked off and I was left standing behind the tills for half an hour with no access to them as both staff and customers thought I was a new manager. Hey everyone, Moose here. Just reminding you I'd like to give a massive thank you to all the Redditors who share their stories and can make these videos possible and to all of you guys watching at home. Take it easy and stay safe.